What's up everyone, welcome to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to use Google Trends to come up with different YouTube video ideas. So if you have a YouTube channel, this could be a very, very useful video for you because as we go through Google Trends, I'm going to come up with a bunch of different YouTube content ideas using Google Trends and I'm just going to enter them all here in my notepad. Now I would generally do this in Microsoft Excel, but it's much easier just to use notepad for this example, so that's what I'll be doing. So the way that I go about finding content ideas on YouTube is you can use the explore section, you can enter a search term here, or you can enter a topic. So for example, if we click the World Cup topic that they have here, you can see we're looking worldwide past seven days. Now what you wanna do when you're coming up with YouTube ideas is not use web search, but use YouTube search. So you're actually getting Google Trends data specific to the YouTube search engine, which is going to give you completely different information than what you're getting from web search or image search or Google shopping. So we're looking at World Cup worldwide past seven days. So as we scroll down here, you can first see the interest by region, but where you can really come up with a lot of different topic ideas is looking at the related search queries and the related topics. So with the related queries over here, you can see all of the rising different trends that are rising, things people are searching the most. If something is showing a breakout here, then that means there's a 3,000% increase. So you can see the big increases over here for topics, 2,200, 800, 550. A lot of these are trending topics because the World Cup is happening right now. So as we come over here, what you're gonna see is all of these are different topic ideas. So you can create recaps for each and every game. Let's say you're watching the Croatia versus Canada game. At the end of the game, you create a recap and then you publish it to your channel and it's really that simple. And if you're doing this, you're gonna get views on your YouTube channel because this is what people are actively searching and looking for. So people may be looking to watch the game, but there's also gonna be a group of people that are looking to actually get a recap, looking to get an information about the games. You could do a pre-video where you're actually previewing the games and then a post-video where you're actually looking at what happened during the games. So this is how you can use Google Trends by using a topic like the World Cup to find some of these related search queries, not only rising, but also top, to see what the top things people are searching for, to make sure that you're satisfying exactly what people are looking up. Now related topics for rising, you can also see top here. So you can see some of the main topics related to the FIFA World Cup. But where I really come up with content ideas is I'm gonna focus more on the related queries over here. So let's just say for example, for my YouTube channel, I need to create some new videos about advertising. So I'm gonna use advertising, I'm gonna use the topic, I'm going to switch this to the United States, and then instead of past seven days, I'm gonna look at the past 12 months, so we're gonna look at the past year, all categories, YouTube search. Now I can switch the all categories and make sure I'm in business and industrial, but we're gonna leave it open and see if we have any, any issues with that. Now you're seeing some peaks over here as we start to get closer to Black Friday and Cyber Monday, but as we scroll down here, coming up with some different ideas for advertising and specifically to YouTube videos. So we come over here to related queries and rising. You're not always gonna get the best things here because some of these are not things that I would ever make a video about. Want a break from the ads? I'm sure everyone's getting bombarded with advertisements right now because it's currently Cyber Monday as I make this video. So we're looking at the related search terms here. A lot of these I can't really do too much with on my channel. so. These aren't as good as it could be for something like top. Now you can try to cover some of these different advertisements. Maybe they're good advertisements. Some of these are kind of all related to politics. The one thing you can see here in rising is TikTok ads. So if I see TikTok ads here and Facebook ads, those are two different topics that I can use. But instead of using rising, let's use top. So when I'm looking up advertising, what I'm looking for is what are some different related search queries that I could make a video about? So these aren't really gonna be overly helpful, so let's keep going. YouTube ads, so I just actually put together a ton of different YouTube ads tutorials and different things like that and published them to my channel. Facebook ads, advertising, commercial ads. So what I can do is take some of these different keywords like TikTok ads, um, let's see if we get any more over here. So that's all, but if we come over here to Facebook ads, so let's click on Facebook ads. Now what we can do is come into Facebook ads, scroll down, Looking at related search queries, what we can do is come here, open up our notepad, and we're just gonna start typing some of these out. So anything that's coming up, so I'm gonna enter a few of these different keywords here. 
Okay, as I'm looking at these, I did click on the related queries for Facebook ads. So we're looking at Facebook ads, the search term, but you're going to see it brought me back into web search. So we want to make sure we come over here and go back into YouTube search. So we want to make sure we're in YouTube search doing this information. So we'll scroll down here and let's look at the top. So now what we're seeing are related queries related to what people are actually searching on YouTube. So we're getting some really good keywords here. So I first started to take out some keywords from when we were looking at web search. It's not as good as you're gonna get when you're doing things specifically for YouTube search. So let's start to take down some of these related search queries. I'm gonna fast forward through this a little bit. Okay, so I took down some of these keywords here. I have how to run and make Facebook ads, Facebook ads manager, Shopify Facebook ads, and then I have Google ads down here as well. So let's keep going over and look for more ideas. So Facebook ads tutorial, real estate Facebook ads. So you're getting all of these different ideas and you can see it's really quick and easy to come up with a lot of different content ideas just by using Google Trends. And what we're seeing are the top related search queries. Now let's come up to the top here. We're looking at the past 12 months. We're gonna instead do 2008 to present. So we're gonna go 2008 to present, YouTube search, United States, specific to the Facebook ad search term. We're scrolling to the bottom and we're looking at related queries and we're in the top related queries. So again, we're gonna keep finding more and more keywords here. A lot of these are similar to what I've already added, but what you're gonna see is, I may have something like Facebook video ads, that gives me a new topic I can create a video about. Best Facebook ads. So what you can do is take these different search related queries here, and what you're doing is something like best Facebook ads, I can create some type of video saying, five best Facebook ads examples to learn from. So something along those lines. So you can come up with different topic ideas and content ideas just by looking at these related search queries. So Facebook lead ads. Now we have Instagram ads down here so we can make sure that we start to add that as a search query because I can cover Instagram ads as well. Drop shipping, Facebook retargeting ads. So I could do something, Facebook ads for drop shipping, Facebook retargeting ads. So we're looking up Facebook ads content ideas and you can see right here I have about 10 different ideas of videos I can make and I know each one of these videos if I make them is going to get over 10,000 views. So to me it could be a successful video and I've used all just using Google Trends data to come up with these different ideas. Now if we come over here to related topics we're going to see nothing overly helpful here as far as related topics you're seeing Shopify connected to Facebook obviously so making sure we have a Shopify series can be really helpful but the other good thing about Google Trends is we're looking at these related queries here is we found a bunch for Facebook ads so and now let's click on Instagram ads and we're looking at Instagram ads from 2004 to present obviously it wasn't overly popular early on once it launches it becomes more and more popular we see a dip and we're kind of seeing this pretty steady here. So United States, 2004 to present, make sure we are using YouTube search. So now we're looking up Instagram ads, YouTube search, what has trended since 2008 to present. Keep coming down here and we are going to do, let's start with rising and just look. So Instagram story ads. So now we have a second topic here, Instagram story ads. So obviously the two main things I need to do is come up with an Instagram ads tutorial and create a video about Instagram story ads. So keep coming over, you see Shopify here. So again, Instagram Shopify ads. So we're just trying to come up with different topic ideas that we can use for our own YouTube channel so we can keep increasing our views. How to run Instagram ads, that's gonna be similar to here. How to run, create. So we have another one, how to create Instagram ads, Instagram video ads. So I could do Instagram ads for followers. So you can see that one right here. So we're gonna keep coming over. Instagram marketing, Instagram. So all these are kind of related to Instagram tutorial, but I could always say Instagram sponsored ads and that could become an idea down the road. So quickly, as I've been making this video about Facebook and Instagram, just by using the search term of Instagram and Facebook. Now let's say if we use Facebook ads here, so now we have the topic of Facebook ads. Let's see if we get any different information using the topic of Facebook ads rather than the search term. All categories, YouTube search, United States. So we actually don't have enough information here. But what you see over here is some of these different topics. So I click on advertising the topic. Come over, we're looking at YouTube search again. Make sure we have YouTube search. Advertising 2008 to present. And looking at these top search queries, we can come up with all sorts of different ideas that we can use for our own YouTube channel, TikTok ads, Facebook ads. 
Obviously, TikTok ads is becoming more popular, so that's becoming a rising search query, and it's becoming one of the top queries as well. So we can see some of these different related search queries. A lot of times with advertising, the Super Bowl commercials dominate this in Google Trends. So you may have to come in here and click on one of these topics to find the best ideas. So if we come to top, let's say none of these topics are too good. So let's just finish off this video by looking at marketing and we'll look at the topic of marketing again, YouTube search, and we'll scroll to the bottom. So related queries, so marketing strategies, digital marketing. So obviously strategies here is something I can come up with some different ideas, affiliate marketing for beginners, Instagram marketing, Amazon affiliate marketing. So looking at these rising related search queries, you can come up with so many different ideas and I can even just create short videos saying, you know, what is ClickBank? What is brand marketing? How to take your brand marketing to the next level? Pinterest marketing. Here's 10 Pinterest marketing ideas. So now once we go from rising, we go back to top affiliate marketing, network marketing, so you can see all of these related search queries and different things that I could start to try to create some different videos about. So hopefully that makes sense as you're coming up with different YouTube video ideas. Just by doing this, I haven't even gone into Google ads. I haven't gone into TikTok ads. I haven't even looked at any keywords related to meta ads, but you can see I've came, I've come up with between Facebook ads and Instagram ads. I have about 15 to 20 different video ideas that I know if I execute are going to take my channel to the next level because I'm missing these videos and they're clearly things that people are searching. They're trending topics. They're really popular. They're coming up in Google trends as things people are searching related to the topics that I cover on my YouTube channel. So I got to get started on creating some more videos here. And hopefully this is a vi helpful video as you try to come up with different YouTube content ideas. So if you have any questions about this, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.